I have a question. So it was uh, quite fascinating to listen to you talking about the pure consciousness and the singularity in that. Is it accurate to say that a water drop is to the ocean as a man is to the pure consciousness? Yes, but in, in a sense, uh, as long as a water drop wants to have a dialogue, he can have a dialogue with the ocean. Ocean is also identity. Ocean is the collective ego in our example. And a drop is an individual ego. But then at the end of the day, we are calling ocean, ocean, drop, a drop. These are names. Then when the drop recognizes its oneness and it loses its identity, the ocean also stops feeling itself as the collective of all the drops because it's also the drop. And so moving beyond names, what lies there is something we just cannot pinpoint. We cannot conceptualize. We cannot comprehend. We cannot objectify. It's, it's just the basis. It's just the pure foundation. But yes, I agree with you. As long as I call myself a drop, I would need the ocean in relationship to which I would be the drop. Even the drop is a relational concept. Thank you. For more free teachings from Acharya Staneshwar, visit www.vimarshafoundation.org. And if you enjoyed learning this, please share this post widely.